Hey guys, I haven't done one of these Amazon videos in forever. And I did tell you that once I updated my fall winter wardrobe, I would do one of these videos just sharing some of the things I purchased from Amazon with you. I will post all the links to all the items in the description box. So definitely go check those out if there's something you see and love. I didn't need that much stuff, but I did want to add a few new pieces for everyday wear, for church lounging, and a few extra shoes and belts, accessories like that. So I'm going to show you everything I've bought in the last month or so and put the links in the description box below. Check them out. The first thing is this super cute bodysuit. I don't know if you guys wore these when you were in elementary school, but I did. I remember having quite a few when I was 11 and 12 and they were super in style back then and they're back and they are adorable with high-waisted jeans. So I got this one and I got another cream colored one. It, I love them both. I'm probably going to get this one in a cream because I like the high neck and it's very comfortable. It's not very warm, but it's perfect for like a day in the 50s or 60s and you can put a little sweat or a cute jacket over it but my favorite way to wear it is with high-waisted jeans if they're high-waisted skinny jeans sneakers look really cute with it or you can dress it up with boots or booties so that's the first item let me show you what else I got okay it was really hard to find a spot with good lighting so hopefully this isn't too bright <laughs> I feel like it is but it's better than too dark right so I'm gonna start with accessories. I'm not gonna model anything because that is so not my style. Like you can look at the model on Amazon. So I'm not gonna show, but I will link some seamless bras and panties in the description box if you're interested in upgrading your undergarments. I have loved just like as close to my skin color as possible, seamless undergarments. They're the way to go. They look, they work with everything. So definitely check out the awesome deals on Amazon. I'll post the links in the description box. I have loved every pair that I've gotten, both bras and panties. Um, I recently got these belts. I have not used them yet, but I've tried them on and they're super cute. So I will wear them. I'm just waiting for when I feel like the outfit needs it. But basically they are these waist belts. There's black, white, gray, and beige this is the one i tried on and it just comes apart like that it's elastic so it can be for high-waisted jeans or dresses or over cardigans anything that you want to create a waist for that doesn't have a waist or just around pants through the regular belt loops and then you just do that and you've got your belt and all the colors i think it was less than 20 dollars for all four super cute i got this adorable purse that I must say I'm obsessed with. I've been doing backpacks and big bags for the last several years and this is the first smaller purse I've gotten in a while. It's uh, kind of like a cross body, you know, which I never do this, but I love it. So uh, it's got this cute little tassel charm on the side. It's not super fancy, but it does have a little something to it. This is where I always keep my keys and my phone. And then open it up. There's some good compartments, good space in there. And really space for everything I need. My wallet, my lipstick, some lotion, chopstick, my phone, and my keys. That's all I ever really carry. So perfect. And it looks really nice with any outfit. I got these upgraded some booties. I do want some taller boots, but I don't know when I'll get them or even if I'll get them. I just feel like I'm only wear these on dates and church. So to get some tall boots, they're going to be at least 50 bucks, maybe more just to wear once in a while. Just doesn't really make sense, but I love clothes and shoes, you guys. <laughs> and it's hard as a housewife to learn what to spend money on to have and what not to because it's kind of pointless it's not practical but if i find a reason to get them i will if i don't then it's fine i've got my upgraded just cute beige booties i have black ones from last year that i didn't need to upgrade and really i've been wearing more browns and beiges than anything lately so i don't even know if i'll wear the black and then i got these kind of loafer style flats they're pointed toe beige i wore them several times when it wasn't so cold 
they'll be great in the spring but for now it is too cold for these so i've been mainly wearing sneakers boots and at home my cozy fuzzy slippers which i should show you these are like the most beautiful slippers in the world and i got them on amazon so i'll post a link for these as well love them my awesome moccasin booties they are so warm real leather super comfortable and they go really cute with jeans dresses even shorts i might wear them next spring these were a great find next i'm going to show you the only loungewear i bought this year um because I had plenty from last year. So it's really just a basic little set. Buttons here. Really cute. Very comfortable. I like to tuck the front in and leave the back out. And these are super high-waisted drawstring with the cuffed ankle. I think they're adorable. This amazing robe this velour gray fluff robe. I got it for myself because last winter it was very cold. <laughs> and I would put on my white uh, terry cloth bathrobe and it was great right after a shower, but to walk around the house in, even with like full pajamas underneath, it was just never quite warm enough. And I started looking to see like warmest robes on Amazon and this one came up. It looked super fluffy. It's not terry cloth, it's velour and the price was good. So I went ahead and got one and I'm telling you like the second I get out of the shower, this is what I put on. I put this on the second I get out of bed. I live in this until I get, you know, dressed for the day. So especially this time of year when it's cold, I wear this all night and then right at bedtime, I take it off I get out of bed, put it on, have my coffee in this, do my reading in this, walk around, make breakfast. I, I love this robe. It is my, my robe. And shortly after I got it for myself, I got Hector one because I needed him to feel the wonderfulness of this. So yeah, we're like in our robes all morning. It's really cute actually. So this is another great, great find, great gift idea too. My other rain boots, I loved them, but they went significantly, significantly up in price. So I didn't want to invest in them. They were so, so nice, but I couldn't spend that. So I got these a little higher. I got them higher because um, snow. These are great for hiking around the property, um, rain, and when it snows, that's what I wear with some thick socks, but the snow would easily get into the short ones, so they were great for the garden and for walking, but for the snow, they weren't so great, and also for the snakes. Like, if I do come across a snake again, the higher the boot, the safer my legs, so I got that a little taller for those reasons. They've worked great. I've kept them inside because the other the other ones I don't know if I said what happened to them. The dogs chewed them up. So next, I've got this cute short sleeve sweater knit. It's like a cream color. It looks very bright in that light, but and it's got this cute cuff. It comes pretty low on the arm, so it has a very sophisticated look. I love it with jeans and slacks and even some skirts. So this is really nice. You can wear this in the winter with a nice coat over it, but I did wear it in the fall. This one is a thinner long sleeve and it's got these ruffled wrists. It's really cute. This is more of like a date night. Um, definitely do the front tuck on this one, unless you like that loose long shirt look. I, per I prefer the front tuck and in the fall, which I guess it's still fall, but when it wasn't quite so freezing, I was pulling these up a little. So the ruffle was actually here and it looked really nice. And you could easily dress this up with a cute necklace. It's simple, but it's so nice and classic looking with a little bit of jewelry, it looks um, elevated. So this has been a cute piece that I've worn quite a bit. This is the other bodysuit that I love. It's ribbed cream and it looks adorable with high-waisted jeans, sneakers or booties, gold necklace, a little jacket, and that cross bag. So cute, so cute. Hair down, I love it. So I think I'm gonna get a second one because I was wearing one of my um, shackets over it and it left like all these little fuzzies and it feels like it's, I don't know, just got a little bit messed up with the rubbing of the 
of the fuzzies. So I was thinking maybe I should wear it with more um, sleek jackets that won't leave any fur fuzz on it. Now I'm getting into some outerwear. This is the only cardigan I bought this year. I will see if I've got the links to my cardigans from last year and I'll put them in the description box. They're still super cute. I wear them. They're, they go with a lot of stuff, but I had two or three already, so I didn't want to get more. I just didn't have a light colored one. And as you can see, there's a theme here with light colors. I wanted a cream colored one. So this is like a popcorn, so soft, really, really flattering. It has little pockets in the front. It's not too long and it's not too baggy. And it's just really cute. I love it. And it can be with your... Uh, the sleeves pulled up or long This is nice again with slacks or jeans. You can dress it up. Keep it casual sneakers booties You can do anything these days and then I did get um, two new uh, Jackets is that what it's called or shackets? I don't know Anyway, this one I had last year and it's still a favorite I wear this I wore this like crazy last year and I already wear it all the time now my favorite way to wear it is with a white shirt, a light colored shirt under with high waisted jeans and white sneakers. It's just so cute. And I usually wear it open. So this is my favorite from last year. I got a new one this year, which I had been eyeing last year, but I didn't get. And I do not regret getting it. I love it. It is so cute on. It's a little different. It's got the pockets here and of course, different pattern and color. So very nice. It actually goes really well with this color. And then this one is more simple. It's a corduroy, just plain cream. And it's beautiful with jeans. It just, I don't know, it's so casual, but it makes you feel dressed up also. It's really, really nice. And I love the light colors right now. So I used to wear, you know, the jean jacket look with the maxi skirts all the time. And I had my jacket, I would say like 11 or 12 years, and the style of it, the fit of it, I started to get a little tired of, so I gave it to Goodwill last year, and I thought I wouldn't want one again, but I did, so I got a new one, and I love it. It's a Jessica Simpson brand, and I know it'll last me another decade. Really cute color, and the fit is nice. It's a little bit lighter weight than the one I had. The one I had, I liked it, I mean, it worked for a decade, but... It was a little, uh, not bulky, but stiff. It was like stiff. This one's a little more thin and flexible. So not for winter, but great for not so freezing days and really cute with dresses. And then I got a couple of dresses, really warm dresses with some fleece leggings. I could wear this at home or out. I, I have no idea when I'll wear them, but I can wear them anytime. And they are the softest material ever they are so so soft and i love them i got this light gray one it's kind of like a baby doll with pockets of course dresses with pockets was all the rage this year long sleeves really really sweet soft and a nice length and this more uh kind of champagne more like a pinkish with buttons along the side so cute and long this one has a different cut to it there's no like waist it's just kind of curves in when you put it on and then really cute buttons I I like them both they're not super thick they're very soft they will be warm but I do recommend you're not gonna wear leggings under them to wear some kind of shapewear under them because I do think that you can see all the lines of your undergarments and your shapeliness too easily through that dress th through both of them so i i have shapewear but i intend to wear these with fleece leggings um or with um tights right like if it's not super cold you can wear it with tights and boots but i got these uh gray thick fleece leggings and i also got some navy ones and they're so soft and i don't need to wear them just yet but in the months to come these will be definitely in probably the daily so that is all i wanted to show you guys if i forgot anything i will put it in the description box i think there's a couple of things that were in the wash actually some jeans that i wanted to show you 
And if there's anything else that I forgot, I'll put it in the descri description box anyway. So you can go check. I know this is holiday time and we're shopping for other people, but in case you want to get a few items for yourself or put some on your wish list to ask your husband or your mom for, I, um, I think it's important to have a couple of new items for the new season so you feel beautiful and you're warm. <laughs> I also, uh, I asked for some duck boots from Hector and silk pillowcases from my mom and I think that's it. I feel like I asked for something else and I can't remember what it was. Share what you liked most in the video, what you think you might get for yourself or somebody you love and what is on your Christmas wish list. Thanks for watching you guys. God bless you and see you next time.